Welcome back to Wigs with Scarlet. Today I am doing a wig review of this beautiful premium luxury hair human hair wig from McKenna. If you're interested in learning more about McKenna, make sure to stay tuned. And if you like what I'm doing here, please remember to subscribe to my channel. This review is coming up. <music> All right, I am reviewing this beautiful luxury human hair wig from McKenna Wigs today and telling you a little bit more about their brand. So I wanna start off with letting you look at this lovely wig from all the angles and talking a little bit about the hairline and the different things that McKenna offers. So this is measured from the crown. So up here it is 20 inch, 20, 21, 20, 21 inches from the crown. And we're gonna look at this from all sides first to start off. So here obviously is the front. This is the left side. The back. And the right side. So I have wanted to try this brand for a very long time. Well, I mean, long time in relativity of me wearing wigs for just a year now. But since the very beginning, I've known about McKenna and I've heard a lot of amazing things about McKenna. And I have to say that most of the things I've heard really, um, the brand lives up to the hype. This particular brand has probably one of the best hairlines, if not the best hairline I've ever seen on a wig. So I want to start off by zooming in on this hairline and letting you look at the true artistry of the, what I like to call art of illusion. I mean, my goodness, look at this. It is so realistic and flawless. Who would ever think that this wasn't growing out of my head? Probably nobody. The other thing I wanna get into a little bit is about the, the quality of the hair. This is their premium hair. And just to point out, McKenna does have a premium line, which is uh, said to be Mongolian texture. And then they have a Remy human hair line that is not the premium, but still good hair. On the descriptions there, premium hair dries perfectly straight. And their Remy human hair, which is not premium, uh, dries with a slight wave. Both of them are very good. This, the premium obviously would be a slight grade above the regular Remy human hair. So this, this brand has also a lot of silk top wigs. So I, you know, there's usually two camps. You've got your silk tops and your lace tops. And I am a diehard lace top fan, although many people love silk tops. Now silk tops are going to last longer than lace tops just in general. And, um, they are very popular with a lot of ladies. I'm a diehard lace top girl. So they do have lace tops on their site, but they do have more silk tops than lace tops. So I wanna make that known about the brand. They do a lot of silk tops, they do some toppers, and then they do have lace tops, but more silk tops than lace tops. I think I just was really repetitive there, sorry. <laughs> I think I said the same thing like three times in a circle. Uh, just blame it on perimenopause brain, guys. Okay, um, so I want to talk about the cap. I'm gonna take this off and talk about the cap and also let you know that this is a size small and I usually wear a small and I would say this one is a little bit small on me. So I would say that their caps run a little bit smaller than average. So you have a beautiful extended velvet nape with a very long comb. A lot of them are much shorter than this. You have a long comb here. This one has the silicone strips, nice small wefting, very comfortable silicone ear tabs and combs on both sides. And this is what we call a double lace top. So we have the first layer of lace here and a second layer here to give uh, a more of an illusion of a scalp without having to add scar tape. And I definitely think it works because I, as we know, we have, I have a lot of gray bio hair and I really feel like I don't need scar tape or anything on the part line. The other thing I wanna talk about is the part line because this is a flawless part line. I mean, you don't even see knots at the part line. Oftentimes I see knots at the part line and not at the hairline, but even on the part line, I'm not seeing knots. 
And for somebody who loves to part on the side, I'm gonna put her back on. Um, I have to say that a lot of times I struggle with side parts because with a lot of brands because everybody's so obsessed with middle parts these days. And, and the struggle that I find with um, side parting for so many of the wigs that I encounter is that the wefts go over, the wefts hit like right here, so you can't get a deep side part. And I don't have that issue with this one. This is a much deeper side part than I'm able to get with a lot of my wigs. And I really love that. So if you're a side part girl, these wigs really are um, great for, for side parting. I have a much deeper part here than I usually do. And I love that. So the hair is very silky. It does not tangle much. Um, I have not washed her yet or found out how she air dries, but I will tell you that this particular beauty is not mine. It was loaned to me by one of my hair loss sisters, and I'm so grateful to Heather for that uh, because I, I can't buy all these wigs, guys. I would literally be in bankruptcy court if I was to buy everything that I reviewed. So this was a, a wig that she let me borrow. She has told me that the, she has washed it and the wig dries beautifully. Uh, without any frizz it's very very beautiful air dry on this piece so um i don't have the experience with it but i have been told from others including heather that the premium line air dries absolutely gorgeous although i don't have personal knowledge i'm trying to bring everybody lots of different content in being able to make some decisions on wigs and that's why i've worked with some of my hair loss sisters to borrow some okay so mckenna I do have quite a few premium brands and I can say that this hair is very, very smooth and soft and not a lot of tangling at all at the nape. It's definitely luxury premium hair. The hairline is absolutely amazing. This is a, uh, I would say a warm blonde, dimensional warm blonde, and you'll see that the root is darker here and then kind of goes into this ombre of a light brown blended with blonde and then the ends are blonder. And I actually love this color. I love a warm, I'm a warm girl because I wear reds most of the time and I love a warm blonde, especially one that has a darker root. So I think the coloring is fantastic. It does not have as much shine as I've seen on some of my other wigs. And what I mean by that is human hair shine. So when we're talking about human hair, we're not talking about a synthetic shine, but some of my hand painted pieces have more of a natural hair shine than this particular wig. This one doesn't have as much shine as I've seen on others, but this is the only McKenna that I've tried. And so I wouldn't say that that's straight across the board. It's just one thing that I noticed is a little bit of a lack of shine. And that could be because it is textile dyed. I don't know if it's textile dyed. I'm saying that could be one thing. Sometimes when they're textile dyed, um, it takes some of the shine out of the hair, but I do not know if this wig was hand painted or textile dyed. I just know that it is um, missing a little bit of that shine, but it definitely would not stop me from wearing this beauty, not with a hairline like this and not with the coloring like this and not with the premium hair, the premium lace cap. I mean, look at this part line. Almost all of my wigs have... Um, some knots at the part line, almost all. I have to do powder, I have to do scar tape. This is the first double lace top I've tried and I'm loving it. So I'm going to show you as I always do more with the color. I always get my hand in the way. And if you've watched me for a while, you know that my color is best in front of my slider. Really a pretty, pretty dimensional warm blonde. And you notice how it gets lighter towards the ends. So I'm going to take you outside, although, ow, sorry, knocked my foot down. Although it's not a super sunny day. It is actually a really beautiful day though. Not too cold. Look at that beautiful color. Really pretty. And McKenna definitely does some custom hand painted color. And I don't know, again, if this one is custom hand-painted, but they definitely have custom hand-painted. And then they may have some that are textile dyed. And remember guys, textile dyed is a good thing because you're gonna have less fading. I actually am a huge fan of textile dye. So if you can get one with a part line and hairline like this that might be textile dyed, that's a win-win because hand-painted color is gonna fade way, way faster than textile dyed. Look how pretty the color is. Pretty, pretty, pretty. 
All right, so after trying out this wig, uh, McKenna is definitely on my wish list. Again, I think I, I got to show you this hairline again because this is this is one of the best hairlines I have ever seen. Um, hands down, I, it, they are at the top of my wish list. I don't know when I'm going to be able to buy another one because I've spent so much in my first year that it may be a while before I can buy any wigs at all. But McKenna is definitely at the top of my list. And if you're looking at McKenna and you're interested in luxury premium human hair, remember they have a lot of silk tops and they also have a Remy line that is a slight downgrade from the premium, but I've heard good things about all their wigs. I've heard amazing things about their regular and their premium hair. So um, I would not hesitate to buy either one if I had the money to buy one. But if you're in the market for a wig, I hope this review was helpful. I hope that you, um, consider McKenna because I would definitely say that their prices are better than some of the other larger brands. Um, I feel like their, their prices are pretty fair for what you're getting. And I also have heard really great things about the owner um, who runs McKenna. She's really responsive. She really takes time with you and helps you. And I love, you know, I love brands like that. I love it when they're, the owners are, are helping out our new ladies. So if you're interested in a human hair premium wig, one that's gonna last you a while if taken care of properly, definitely check out McKenna because I'm really, really impressed with this brand. And I hope all of this was helpful and I will see you next time.